Happy Friday, everybody. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com with another four-box random team break of 2016-17 Panini Select Soccer. Break number two. Big thanks to these folks right here. Let's copy and paste. One spot gets you two teams. There's all the countries right there. And let's randomize each list. One and a four. Five times. One, two, three, four. And four. And five. One more. Five times. All right. After five times, we've got Kip down to Sam. And then one and a four, five times for the countries. One, two, three, four, and fifth and final time. After five times, we've got the Ivory Coast, Cote d'Ivoire on top, and Romania in the 32 spot. Let's paste that right there. All right, so Kip Kip Hooray with Cote d'Ivoire. We got Sen Yin with the Netherlands. Ashley, you have Mexico. Jason, you have the United States and Germany. Ashley with Russia. Jason with Chile. Spain for Moody. EJ, you got Portugal. William, you got Croatia. Sam Golden, Iceland. Daniel with Montenegro. France, Le Bleu for Sen Yin. Eric Jennings, Northern Ireland. Shannon, England. TJ, Hungary, Wales, Daniel, Sweden, Moody, Poland, Ashley, Turkey, Jason L. with Ireland, Daniel Patera with Bosnia-Herzegovina, Brazil for William, Shannon with Uruguay, Austria for Ashley, Ukraine for Jason, Colombia for Senyin, Jason L. Argentina, Daniel, Slovenia, Senyin, Italy for Zazuri, Belgium for Kip Kip Hooray and Sam Golden with Romania. Let's alphabetize. And while you are considering trades, let's see which four boxes we're going to do. So there's all the four boxes right there. One, two, three for the left side. Four, five, six for the right side. And it's going to be five. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we're going to be doing this side. These four boxes will save for the next break, which is already in the store. So this is ran that's random team three. And here are the four boxes for Random Team 2. William wants to see if uh, there's a Croatia for Romania deal. Sam, if you're, if you're available, if you're listening. Um, the music playlist, EJ, yeah, there is a lot more 80s than usual. But not, not 80s heavy, I think. I, I try to divide it up, the playlist up, to, to make it somewhat balanced between various genres and eras. All right, looks like nothing there. Or unless anybody wants Northern Ireland, I'll, I'll entertain a Northern Ireland offer for Eric Jennings before we print. Otherwise, we'll go. Trade offer, trade window, part two, going once, going twice, and close for reals this time. All right. Let's print this out and we will go. Good luck, everybody. Oh, unless Croatia for Northern Ireland, Eric Jennings. I'll entertain that. I'll allow it. There's so I'm always excited when there's a trade. There's so rarely a trade. He'll do it. I'll allow it. All right, William with Northern Ireland now, Eric Jennings with Croatia. Actually, I need to change that on the list too. Just when we print out the labels, it's all correct. All right, so there you go. Now, trade window close again. 
for reals this time. For reals, for real. Not not just for real, for real, for real. All right, good luck, everybody. Quick four box break. Remember, the last four boxes of this case are in the store right now, jazbeeshobbyland.com. So check it out. Do not miss out. We had a great match today, folks. I think we're, we're only, what, a few matches in? Maybe four matches into the World Cup. But the, the latest match between Portugal and... And Spain was incredible from start to finish with some incredible goals, incredible plays, exciting football, exciting soccer from start to finish. So very entertaining. And hopefully that's a sign of things to come. All right, good luck, everybody. Here we go. Claudio Bravo leads things off. There's Chicharito. We'll save one of these uh, Cristiano Ronaldo's for Portugal. These will kind of breeze by just because they're not numbered, but they will ship. These uh, these base cards right here, these commons won't ship. Just FYI. And there's a die cut of Wayne Rooney. Obviously, that will ship. That goes to England. Shannon with England. 75 out of 149 on that die cut. And we've got, for Ireland, Shea Given. Two-color relic for the keeper. That goes to Jason Lawner with Ireland. Is that not numbered? No, not numbered. Not numbered relic. Bobby Wood. And wow, this is a nice time to get this Cristiano Ronaldo die cut. That goes to Portugal. That'll be for EJ. Cristiano Ronaldo, of course, with a hat trick today against Spain. Pretty incredible performance. 212 out of 249. That might cover the spot. I wouldn't be surprised if it did. Sergio Ramos, tie-dye. That goes to Spain, Moody, with Espana, as 14 out of 30 on that one. And we have Paul Pogba, National Pride. These National Pride set a little bit thicker. Le Bleu, Senyin, last spot mojo. Yeah, Sergio Ramos, who took down Mohamed Salah in the... Champions League final. Probably probably a new nemesis for me, Eric Jennings. That is for sure. There's Gigi Buffon. 121 out of 199 for Forza Azuri. Sen Yin with Italy. We'll save that Christian Pulisic too. He's the future of American soccer. And we got more Cristiano Ronaldo. For Portugal. I don't remember seeing this much Portugal in our previous breaks of this ages ago. But that's another one for EJ. Jason Lawner with Christian Pulisic, the future of American soccer. There he is right there. So he'll he'll have a couple uh couple of World Cup cycles in him. Two or three, I'm sure. He's that young. Carlos Baca. I don't know why he was flipped around, but there it is. And there you go. I'll save one of these Gareth Bales, too, for Wales. It's for TJ with Wales. All right, that was box one. Here's box two.
Good luck, everyone. The match is tomorrow for Saturday. So today's Friday the 15th. The match is tomorrow on the 16th, Saturday, very early Saturday. We've got three, four, sorry, check that, four matches coming up on Saturday at 3 a.m. Pacific, 6 a.m. Eastern on Saturday, France facing Australia. I don't think France should have too much trouble with the Australians. And then a few hours after that, 6 a.m. Pacific, 9 a.m. Eastern. Might be a little early for West Coasters, but could be good for East Coasters. Argentina, Lionel Messi, and Iceland, who were the upstarts of the 2016 Euros. That could be a fun match to watch. Maybe see if there's going to be an upset. Maybe see Lionel Messi do Lionel Messi things. I mean, Cristiano Ronaldo and Lionel Messi are always kind of compared as who's the best player in the world right now, blah, blah, blah. This is a chance for uh, Lionel Messi to answer. At 9 a.m. Pacific, 12 p.m. Eastern, Peru, Denmark. And then uh, a few hours after that, at 12 p.m. Pacific and 3 p.m. Eastern, that'll be Croatia, Nigeria. All right, there's Aaron Ramsey of Wales. Gigi Buffon. And we've got Adrian Ramos. There you go. The Colombian. Oh, and Lucas Pizzek. That's he's So this is a randomizer actually. They're both on the same team. Same club team, Dortmund. That's a randomizer between Colombia and Poland. That's between Senyin and Moody. We'll set that right there. We've got Renato Sanchez, 009 out of 249 for Portugal. That'll be for EJ. And we've got 11 out of 49 emerging star signatures, David Ospina. For Colombia, that'll be for Sen Yin. When do they play? I don't think Colombia plays until Tuesday. Yeah, they their first match is against Japan next Tuesday. And then we've got Diego Rolan, 27 out of 149. Argentina, nice purple die cut for Jason L. Kevin Strutman for the orange and for Iceland. There you go, we got sky's the limit. We've got Birker Bjarnson. Bjarnason. Sky's the limit for him, apparently. That goes to Iceland, Sam Golden. Will they pull off the upset? I don't know. Argentina did struggle a little bit in the qual. I mean, they took until their last qualifying match to secure a World Cup spot. So they, ju they just narrowly got in, which is kind of weird to think about. But could Iceland surprise them? We got Daniel Sturridge out of 199. Select swatches for the England forward, Shannon with England. Does England have a chance to win it all? They're always in the mix. If they could put it together, maybe, if that guy's on fire. Along with Harry Kane, Jamie Vardy, that could do it. There's Harry Kane right there at a 299, 007 out of 299 for England's number nine. Shannon with that one. Two more boxes to go. Good luck, everybody. All right. You yeah? out? Yeah. Have a good one. Yeah. I'll see you tomorrow. I don't know who's gonna. I, I say. I still say Spain. 
I, 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 I say Spain. I already got, I already got my picks locked in. Oh, Spain. I've got Spain. I, I picked four underdog winners. Spain at plus 600, France at plus 700, Belgium, a longer shot pick at plus 1100, or England, plus 1600. Wow. But I think Spain's going to do it. Even with their rough draw today against Portugal, but I think that might wake them up a little bit and say, we got to we gotta start hauling. Every major country, ladies and gentlemen, needs like a little bit of a... A little bit of a wake-up call sometimes early in the tournament. That might be the one for uh, for Spain. And again, folks, the uh, last four boxes of this case of select right here is uh, is in the store. So check it out. All right, we got Aaron Ramsey for Wales. That goes to TJ. 48 out of 299. Wales not in it. Although they had a pretty nice 2016 Euros campaign. We got Mats Hummels. For Germany, nice die cut. 75 out of 249. For the Germans, Jason Lawner with that. And then Seamus Coleman for Ireland. 121 out of 199. Old Seamus selects swatches for Jason L. And Ireland. Dries Martins. And behind Luis Suarez is the other England forward, Jamie Vardy. If Harry Kane and Jeremy Vardy, if they're on, Daniel Sturridge comes on as some sort of super sub or something like that, that could be hard for a lot of teams to stop. That prolific offense. There's national pride for Portugal. Rui Patricio. 5 out of 10. Nice one for EJ and Portugal. There you go, Eric. Nice. These look great. They, probably, they look even better in person. That card is gold, Eric Jennings. Gold, I tell you. More gold for Ukraine. Ruslan Rotan. 32 out of 125. That'll be for Jason L. And Ukraine. There's Anthony Martial. 21 out of 60. Nice autograph for Le Bleu. That goes to Sen Yin. France. If they put if they get their S together, they could have a good chance of winning. They've got a pretty complete team. You just gotta put it all together. And as for Sen Yin and France, last spot mojo. Hey, you're welcome, Eric Jennings. I had that Portugal doing well in this one. And a tie-dye, love these tie-dyes. It's Edison Cavani. The Uruguayan. And it's Paris Saint Germain shirt. Playing very well. 9 out of 30. Some people have, have Uruguay as a sort of dark horse candidate for the for a World Cup win as well. If Luis Suarez and uh, if Luis Suarez and Ez Gavani they start clicking and scoring. It's gonna be hard to stop that team too. I think um I think the issue with – there's Luis Suarez right there. The issue with Uruguay is that they've got a great offense. They've got great forwards. And they've got a great uh, defense. But then they kind of soft in the middle. Kind of soft in the middle. And that, that will certainly be an issue for that club if they don't – Kind of solve that. They narrowly beat Egypt one nil. If if they had a one hundred percent healthy Mohamed Salah, that could have been a tie. That could have been a win for Egypt. So Uruguay needs to get their act together. Uh, yeah, Sam Gold. I think we saw. Didn't we see an Iceland relic? 
Or maybe there was like a Sky's a Limit card or something like that. One of those inserts. Oh, is it Suarez? I didn't see the match. Actually, I have a DVR. I didn't see it though. EJ says Suarez missed a couple, a couple opportunities today. A couple sitters, as they say in the UK. Well, if he if he gets his, I mean, he's a wizard on the ball. If he if he, he can score at will at times, if he gets going, it won't matter that they have a soft midfield. All right, last box. Good luck, everybody. And our last four boxes are in the store right now. JaspiesHobbyland.com. Get into it before they're gone. We got Douglas Costa, 25 out of 60. Nice uh, neon green, maybe? Lime green? Die cut for Brazil. That goes to William L. A lot of people have Brazil winning the whole thing. They certainly can. Behind Oscar and John Stones is Moutinho, 160 out of 199 for Portugal. It's another one for EJ. There's Granite Zaka for Switzerland. Uh, we don't have Switzerland on this list, so I'll randomize that to one person in the break. And if there are other countries that are not represented, that'll also go to the Switzerland spot. That's a winner-take-all. There's Gilfie Sig uh No, not Gilfie Sigurdsson. That's Kolbjörn Sigthorsson. Come on, Joe. For Ireland, Robbie Keane out of 249. Die cut. Played for the LA Galaxy for a long time. Jason Lawner. Still does? Actually, don't know. I don't think he does. All right. We got Harry Kane for England out of 199. Select swatches for the three Lions, Shannon. And look at this. Cristiano Ronaldo. Hat trick today. Nice insert there. Now, th these are not numbered, but I have to think that that has some degree of value right there, Eric Jennings with Portugal. That alone might cover the spot. All right, Thibaut Courtois and Vincent Company, double team memorabilia for Belgium. For Kip Kip Hooray with that dual relic. There's Neymar, we'll save one of those two for Brazil. There's Tony Cruz out of 125. Apologies. It's a rubber mat right there, it protects it when I have Amari Cooper hands. Um, Jason Lawner with Germany. With the Tony Cruz. We've got this die cut right here. 30 out of 60. Die cut autograph. That's cool. Joe Hart. England's Joe Hart. Who's got Hart? Shannon with the three Lions. It's pretty cool. Marco Royce. Edison Cavani. And Chicharito at the end. And there you have it, folks. There's the break, the last four boxes in the store. This seems to be a pretty nice case. So get into it. One spot gets you two countries in a four-box break. All right, now let's do a little randomizing here. Let's go back to random.org. Let's get some blank lists here. It's a new dice. All right, so first things first, we're going to see who gets the uh, Switzerland cards on all the other country that may not be represented. Although I think it's just Switzerland, actually. I'll have to add them to the list or something like that. Um, and this was what? Poland and Colombia. All right, and we'll randomize each of those lists 11 times, 5 and a 6. Good luck. Name on top. We'll get the Switzerland cards. One. After 11 times. Two. Three. Come on, ram.org. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. 
And 11th and final time. Name on top after 10 times, or after 11 times, that is. Jason Lawner. There you go, Jason. So you'll get that uh, National Pride card and um, the other Switzerland inserts and refractors if there were any. All right, once again, 11 times for these two countries. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Did I get seven? There's seven. Eight, nine, ten, and 11. Then final time. Team on top, country on top is Colombia. So that goes to Sen Yin with Colombia. You'll get this dual relic right here. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. We'll see you next time for the next break. Maybe some more soccer. Bye-bye.